of one of these students who's been affected. Uh, wants to speak on condition of anonymity, so no name. Uh, thank you very much for joining us. And uh, wh where is uh, your child at the moment? Is it with you at home? Uh, she, she's at home, but she's, she's traumatized. And uh, has she been able to give you a reason why they shot the video in the first place and some of the things that were said in the video? Why did they say those things? Well, actually, uh, when I spoke, even when the incident occurred, and then we we we, we spoke to our daughter, uh, she said that they were always joking. Their intent was not to throw it out there into the media, and that uh, they didn't know one of them was secretly recording, and that uh, she recorded, and unfortunately. The, the, the video leaked, but uh, you could see from their, their, their composure, their, their reactions that they themselves were shocked that it leaked. So uh, what it means is that uh, they were joking, you feel exuberant or something, mm -hmm. uh, unfortunate on their part, one of them recorded and, and, and then released the video out there, yes. Okay, I, I, but what do you make of, uh, how, what is your understanding of the letter? Does it mean that they are not supposed to return to that particular school or they are not supposed to return to any public school at all? Well, I, I am not abreast with uh, GES uh, policies uh, on, on dismissals, but I, I want to believe that uh, uh, what I know is that when a student is dismissed, they make copies of the letters to the other schools so that such a student uh, uh, will not gain admission into any other uh, public school. But, uh, I, I, and that is where the worry is. Mm. That is where the worry is as a parent, because I, I know I have not read the, the report that was for, because I want to believe the director general took his decision based on a report that was submitted to him by the school, so I have not read the report. I don't know the contents of the report. Hmm. But I, 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 I want to believe that uh, we are, let me say we, we, we are a bit harsh. Hmm. Uh, in as much as we, we condemn more reservedly the, the behavior of the student, because no responsible parents would condemn what they did. Right. And one would say his daughter or his son should go out there and be insulting elderly people who are old enough to be your father or your grandfather. Right. But I think uh, uh, we should have tempered justice, or we should still temper justice uh, with mercy, and then uh, uh, not just throw them out there to the wolves. Okay. I, 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 I think that is where there was. If, if, if those institutions are, and then they misbehave, and mm. we cannot correct them, we throw them out to, to, to the wolves. I, I think we are in a way also... Uh, so I'm sure you are thinking of what next of to do society. as a parent. Uh, what would that be? Would you probably try to seek some redress? How, how do you intend to, you know, move on with this issue? Uh, well, we are pleading to media houses like yourself and others who can, uh, uh, quote unquote, drum our issue out there so that uh, if somebody can help us. But as it stands now, uh, you cannot fight against a force. Uh, a storm that is too too strong. We can't mm. fight against that storm. But we are only pleading that uh, I'm sure those who took the decision, they are also parents. We are yeah. pleading. We are pleading to their to their conscience that as parents they should uh, uh, relook at the issue and okay. uh, have mercy on these students and, and allow them to return. I'm sure this alone. In fact, look when when the incident happened and then they called me and I went. Mm. My sister cried bitterly and I could see she had run down. Yeah. And it okay. was the same. It was, it was the same with the other students as mm. well. They were traumatized. Then we brought them home. It, it took us weeks before she she could gain okay. some confidence. Okay. So already they had gone through trauma, and then you add salt to injury Just again. To then what do you want them to do? And and I'm afraid some of them may even be harboring suicidal ideas. So okay. I think we we need to really help them. Thank we you. We need to help them. Yes. Thank you for at least agreeing to speak to us uh, on this, and we wish you and uh, your, your ward well. We hope that you get some answers to the many questions on your mind at the moment.